Every living thing produces different elements of the periodic table after the process of petrification, especially trees. All elements in existence have come from a once living organism that's been turned to stone through a cataclysmic event, such as a flood of mineral dense water. Before the worldwide flood, everything living were at least 100x the size that it is today. It's hard to imagine, but the evidence is overwhelming once you study petrification. There are temples and pyramids on the ocean floor which proves they were built on what were once dry lands. This is only possible if the earth had much less water. Imagine how much water a world full of giant trees miles wide and tens of miles high would consume. Then ask yourself what would happen to it all if they no longer existed. Now imagine a world full of decomposing giant trees absolutely covered in logs, stumps, leaves, twigs, and wood chips. Then all the water they once consumed comes bursting up from the pre-existing root structure, creating geysers from the pressurized boiling waters heated by the gigantic piles of decomposing vegetation. Trillions of tons of water begins to flood the world rapidly, dragging everything in its path with it only leaving stumps, pyramids, temples, and megaliths. Once the waters settle down and find their equilibrium, all the matter that had been dragged was deposited and petrified into the land masses we all exist on today. This is my own personal current conclusion after studying this topic for four years. I welcome all criticism, feedback, and praise. It's time to unbind your mind and stop trusting the people charging you to exist.